Hey everyone, today is June 29th, and today's Sapphire is coming up in Austin for the next few weeks. First of all, the scenery is very different because I'm not at home, so excuse that. But recently we actually got an announcement, not in our server at Ian, because I think we're still going through anniversary, so it counts as a limited. But we do have an announcement for the next Spotlight event, and that's going to be for Nikki. And since it just showed the information, we don't know what the stats are or whatever for Nikki's new card. But instead, I'm going to showcase his costume and everything right here instead but like other spotlight events this is going to be more using diamonds so he hopefully he has some diamonds ready for him and if you can't get him right now he'll be in a memorial coin shot later and all that we still have a second anniversary limb scout happening right now and it's going to end tomorrow so if you want to get the watch to do this is going to be like one of your last few days to get him so just a heads up that it's going to go away soon okay but that is it for everything that's limited coming up let's talk about the events coming up so for events coming up currently we are in Kali solo event and after Kali solo event we're going to get soma solo event halo of enlightenment black paradise flycatcher looking to the skies and for this event we're going to get the five star soma so it is a green card of his main stat in vocal and his support skills increase drop rate of all blue pieces and alongside soma we get the four star kato and three stars kudo and nazuno and after solo solo event we're going into our 1.5 story tour arcs and that's going to be a new chapter into the story mode and the first one's gonna be Yunosaki Divided, the Tanabata Festival that bridges hope. And for the story event we're gonna get the 5 star Adonis and 5 star Arashi. Adonis is a yellow card of his main stat and vocal and his support skills increase drop rate of medium blue pieces. And Adonis is SPP of V4 perfectly imperfect. And Arashi is a blue card of her main stat in dance and her support skill is going to be a very new support skill that's going to be introduced and that's going to be increased drop rate of idle pieces. And Ashi's SVP will be 4 Promise Swords. Ashi will be a 3 million point reward, and Adonis will be a 3.5 million point reward. And along with them, we get the 4 star Koga. And Koga's SVP will be 4 Sustained Memories, and 4 star Ritsu. And Ritsu's SVP will be 4 Station Emergency. And we'll also get 3 stars Mao, Mika, Mitsudu, and Tsukasa. Okay, that's it for events coming up. Let's talk about the scouts coming up. Okay, currently for future scouts, currently we are in Nazuna's future scout 2. And after Nazuna's FS2, we're going to get Tsukasa's FS2. And that's going to have the 5 star Tsukasa. Tsukasa is a green card of his main stat in performance. And his support skills increase drop rate of medium yellow pieces. And Tsukasa's SVP will be for Promise Swords. And alongside Tsukasa, we get the 4 star Aida. And Aida's SVP will be for Your Speculation. And we'll also get the 3 star Natsume. And then after Tsukasa's FS2, we're going to get the Kanata's FS2. And that's going to have the 5 star Kanata. Kanata is a green card of his main stat in vocal. And his support skills increase drop rate of large blue pieces. And Kanata's SP will be for Fervor Yusei Nimpocho. And also like Kanata, we get the 4 star Shu. And Shu's SP will be for Eternal Weaving. And we'll also get 3 star Myelin. Okay, that's all for our future scouts coming up. Let's talk about the event scouts coming up. Okay, for event scouts, currently we are in the Sweetling Seekers. After the Sweetling Seekers scout, we're going to get the Bankada Graffiti scout. And that's gonna have the 5 star June. June is a blue card of his main stat in vocal. And his support skills increase drop rate of large blue pieces. And June's SP will be for Awakening Myth. And also I do get the 4 star Kohaku and Kohaku's SVP will be for Lemon Squash Cheers and we'll also get 3 stars Tatsumi and Hiyori and then after the Bunka Graffiti Scout we're going to get the Keito Electro Scout and that's going to have the 5 star Hido Hido is a green card of his main stat in vocal and his support skill is Combo Saver and Hido's SVP will be for Hysteric Humanoid and also I have Hido we get the 4 star Yuzuru and Yuzuru's SVP will be for Miracle Dream Traveler and we'll also get 3 stars Aida, Mika, and Keito okay that's it for event scouts being added next let's talk about the cards being added to the standard pool Okay, for cards being added to the standard pool, once the Kasa's FS2 starts, we're going to get the Kato Future Scout cards added to the standard pool. It's going to have the 5 star Kato. Kato is a yellow card of his main stat in dance, and his war skills increase drop rate of all red pieces. And Kato's SVP will be for Perfectly Imperfect. And also, Kato will get the 4 star Nazuna, and Nazuna's SP will be for Main Tokimeki slash Main Palpitation and 3 star Rene. And then once Bunkada the Graffiti starts, we're going to get the white headdress scout cards added to the standard pool. And that's going to have the 5 star Tori. Tori is a blue card of his main stat in vocal, and his support skills is a of all pieces. And Tori's SP will be for Hajimai no Fantasia slash Fantasia Beginnings. And also, Tori will get the 4 star Tsukasa, and Tsukasa's SP will be for Seishu Emergency. And we'll also get 3 stars Eiichi and Hiyori. And then once Kata's FS2 starts, we're going to get the Ritsu Feature Scout cards added to the standard pool. That's going to have a 5 star Ritsu. Ritsu is a yellow card of his main stat in vocal, and his support skills increase drop rate of large blue pieces. And Ritsu's SPOB for Promised Swords. 
And also I recently get the 4 star Izumi, and Izumi's SP will also be for Promised Swords, and 3 star Rei. And then lastly, once Kato Electro Scout starts, we're going to get the Free Spirit City Rider Scout cards added to the standard pool. That's going to have the 5 star Hiyori. Hiyori is a green card of his main stat in Dance, and his support skills pretty sharply of large red pieces. And Hiyori's SP will be for Awakening Myth. And also have Hiyori, we get the 4 star Midori, and Midori's SP will be for Station Emergency. And we'll get 3 stars Nasuna and Hajime. Okay, that's it for cards being added to the standard pool. Let's talk about the cards being added to Momoa Coin Shop. Okay, for cards being added to Momoa Coin Shop, once Summer Soul event starts, we're going to get the Shuffle Ring of Bell event cards at the mobile coin shop and it's gonna have a five star midori midori is a blue card of his main set advance and his support skills pre drop rate of all red pieces and alongside midori we get the four star keito and four star leo and then once the top of the tour event starts we're going to get the ssr third stage secret service cards added to the mobile coin shop and it's gonna have the five star nagisa and five star madara nagisa is a red card of his main set in vocal and his support skill is lower voltage decrease and nagisa's sp will be for the beast of the end and Mada is a blue card of his main stat and dance, and his support skills increase the Zombo gauge. And Mada's SP will be for Be Ambitious. And all of that, we're gonna get the 4 star Hiyori. And Hiyori's SP will be for Kiseki slash Miracle. And we'll also get 4 star Kohaku. And Kohaku's SP will be for Stippling. And 3 stars Ibada and Jun. Okay, and zip for the cards being added to the World Coin Shop. Let's about the songs being added to the game. Okay, for songs being added to the game, after our current event, we are going to be getting a new song, and that is going to be Hysteric Humanoid by Alkaloid. And since the next event is a solo event, we'll be getting the song Natsudori no Uta Summerbird sung by Akatsuki. And then after that event, we will not be getting a new song after that, unfortunately. And then also since the next event after that is going to be a tour event, we will not be getting a song from that. Okay, that's it for our songs being added to the game. Let's talk about the birthdays coming up. Okay, for birthdays coming up, we have two to talk about. The first one's gonna be on July 1st, and that is gonna be for Sora. And then the next birthday after that will be on July 7th, and that will be for Himeru. Okay, and that is it for everything happening in the next few weeks. There it was a sudden announcement that we are getting the next spotlight. We didn't get it announced for our server in EN yet, and that's most likely due to the fact that we are still going through anniversary right now. And they tend to not like limited to running together, so we'll probably have to wait until after our anniversary to actually get the spotlight event. And also, we are getting to that point where we're gonna actually start a new story arc, and that is going to be two events from now, and I'm really excited to read about that since we are going to be getting a new character that's going to be added to the game. Not playable, but it's going to be very integrated into the story. So I've been really interested in what 1.5 is going to be about. And also, starting from June's scout, it's going to be pretty rough, well for me anyways, because there's just a barrage of characters I want, and yeah, it's not going to be fun, but hopefully I can get all of them. I highly doubt it, but I mean, it'd be great if I could. But anyways, that is it for the video. If you have any comments or questions, feel free to put it down below. If you like the video, feel free to like the video. And if you like the content of the channel, feel free to subscribe to the channel as well. Every little thing helps. But that's it, and also I will try and get the second half of 2024 video out soon. I try to get at least within the next week or so. It's been pretty busy for me, so that's why I haven't really been able to do much in general. But yeah, hopefully that will be out soon. But anyways, hope you have a good day or night wherever you are, and I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching, and peace!